Today we're visiting an MJM 40Z and literally studying it from the bottom up. Well, what we're talking about is specifically the 40Z, the general principles apply across the MJM line. My name's Bill Full, and if you wish to talk about the 40Z or other MJM models, you can reach me at the number or email below this video. Crucial to the MJM 40Z and other MJM's running performance is the waterline length when the boat's operating. In this drawing that you see, you'll notice that the entry of the boat is well forward and uh, certainly longer waterline than other manufacturers provide. This does two things. It gives the, the boat some extra waterline, generating a little extra speed, and with the bow of the boat actually in the water, it mitigates the pitching moment. With the fine entry, as the boat encounters waves, there's a more gentle motion and it either mitigates or actually prevents pounding that is present in other builder's boats. Looking at the next drawing, we show the location of the vertical center of gravity. This is important to understand because it's very low relative to other builder's boats and reduces both, again, pitching moment and, importantly, rolling moment. Last but not least, the third drawing we have is the very fine bow entry, the bow flare, which you they point out which reduces uh, spray and also keeps a little bit of wind away from the boat and then the chines in the bottom of the hull that help aerate the bottom and help provide lift. We hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, hit the subscribe button and again if you have interest in the MJM 40Z or other MJM models, contact me at the email or number below this video. Thanks for joining us.